Senator Veronica Miner. Mr. Speaker, sir, let me first this, uh, take this opportunity to congratulate you on your election as a speaker. I believe this is a great moment for Kenya. We have gotten the best speaker we could have gotten in the Senate House today because we had all the CVs and we had a look at those CVs and I can affirm and endorse you as the right speaker for this Senate House. This Senate House has a heavy responsibility towards the whole nation of Kenya. It has the oversight role over the devolution funds and, and the county governments. We are looking forward to a moment when we can optimize the use of the county funds or the devolved funds that are sent to the counties, not just for one county, but for the 47 counties. Because the only way to realize the bottom-up economic model in this nation of Kenya, through the Kenya Kwanzaa Coalition government, is through proper optimization of the devolved funds to the counties. I believe you have the capacity to do that, to lead that oversight role, and to ensure that Kenyans will not be disappointed with your tenure. Mr. Speaker, sir, regarding the inclusion of women within the leadership of this house, we know that you will also oversight to ensure that all the special interest groups that have been represented in this house will feel that they are part of Senate and will feel that they are part of the leadership of Senate, both at the PSC and also at the committee level of this house. So let me not take too much time, but let me take this opportunity to wish you God's blessings. I know you have the capacity. I have practiced law with you in Mombasa for many years, and I knew you as a sharp advocate who was brilliant and able to perform his tasks on time. And I know this Senate will do what needs to be done to deliver the mandate under the Constitution. God bless you.